Hi all, I will show you a lot of stuff today uh, from uh, landscaping uh, with its unbroken power to input case data into Unreal Engine. First, uh, of course, you have to enable it. Um, we will also use landscaping map box and for that with the Unreal Editor. And then we have to make sure that the AP key is set. Um, it's the access token. Uh, you can find it in uh, your Mapbox account, mapbox.com slash uh, access uh, account. And then you will be able to import the data from Mapbox and we make a new empty world and uh, import a um, chunk of terrain. You always have to import terrain first uh, to have a, a georeferenced area and we will also import a landscape material and this landscape material is free uh, to download with the coupon code um, you will see this in a minute uh, and you can also see it in the description the coupon code where you can get uh, the landscape material on unrealassetstore.com you will install it with the loader pretty quick and here you see the coupon code you select our project and uh, content folder of our project and it will be downloaded and installed automatically and then we uh, selected it and after it's imported we have to save it and make some basic setups to see something here and uh, the next and the very important part is how to use uh, the landscape spline feature first of all we have to enable edit layers on the landscape select the landscape uh, look for enable edit layers uh, and check the box then we have to um, add a layer to the landscape and reserve it for splines Yeah, that's it. We'll save this setup and then we go back to the normal mode, the selection mode, and continue with uh, selecting files from Mapbox and then select landscape splines here. Select a road mesh for the spline segment mesh, and very important, you have to add here the paint layer name because we uh, want to make sure that there is no um foliage on the road we want here this is base layer which have like some plants as foliage but we want uh, we want to have uh, no foliage on the road of course and then we select street here from the shapes and can uh, have a little preview where the streets will be just uh, cranking up the speed to move around more click quickly so this is uh, where this type of street will be spawned as a uh, landscape slide <coughs> and now we can see this see this and we will uh, make sure that there is no foliage on the road there is none and we can uh, see how it behaves in runtime okay I want to have the car here so we might have to switch uh, the game mode. Yeah, you can see there's no foliage, so the, the, this is, is great. And uh, yeah, let's switch the, the game mode. It's vehicle advanced game mode, I think. No, let's hit play. Oh yeah, here we have the car and Let's drive around a little bit. I'd say it's pretty quick to have um, the landscape here with the roads and all set up pretty quickly here. This is the important part um, where it makes sure that there's no foliage on the road. If we select the light right layer path in this case where there's no foliage grass types assigned 
and also there is virtual text output on this free landscape material but this is not covered in this uh, video we will cover this next time so thanks and stay awesome bye